Hello ladies and gentlemen, today we are going to have a nice relaxing game of Alien Isolation. Don't worry, everything is under control. We're going to play this nice and dynamically and systematically. On hard mode, of course. Okay, that looks good. Here we go. Sprinting is the last resort. Sounds some of the alien. I think we know there's going to be an alien in this game now. It's a little bit of a spoiler. <laughs> By the way, if you haven't seen Alien, it's an awesome film. Go watch it now. Probably before watching this. Final report of the commercial starship Nostromo. That's Third very, officer reporting. That's very loud. I'll turn that down. The other members of the crew. Kane. Lambert. Parker. Brett. Ash. And Captain Dallas. Are dead. Cargo and ship destroyed. I should reach the frontier in about six weeks. With a little luck, the network will pick me up. This is Ripley. Last survivor of the Nostromo. Signing off. Ripley? I'm Samuels. I work for the company. He's evil. It's about your mother. We think we may have found her, Amanda. He's lying. A commercial vessel, the Anisadora, has recovered what we believe to be the flight recorder unit of the Nostromo. Where? Zeta Reticula. What did it tell you? We don't know. The unit was taken to Sevastopol Station. It's proprietorial material, so the company wants it to be collected as soon as possible. Sevastopol's a supply depot in the region. It's a, a permanent freeport. I know facility. what it is. It's basically a. Uh, Transit's arranged. There's a courier ship called the Torrens heading out that way in two days. We're going to travel out. We? Oui. Me and another exec. And you, if you're willing. Look, Ripley, when this job came across my desk, I read the case history. I know. Why you're working in the region where she went missing. You're still looking, aren't you? It must be very hot in there. I've been cleared to offer you a place on the Torrance if you want to come along. Maybe there'll be some closure for you. Tube. Ooh. Lovely job, play. Right, I'm just gonna do the volume because it's still a bit loud. Uh. 
Okay, now you can hear my lovely, lovely voice. Sign in. You have signed in, A. Ripley. Now yeah, look. <laughs> the lame. Samuels, that was the... Dude, wasn't it? Taylor. So far. Taylor's interested in... So... Is crouch. War in totality. And of course, Connor. Connor. You. You this way. Save the game. Yes. Override current save game. Ooh, computer. Okay. Uh, if you want to read this, I'll let you pause it. I'm just going to read it quickly. Oops, damn it. Uh, Q for back. They have, of course, uh, reconstructed all the 70s sort of style of the original alien. Now that just turns it off. Alright. Now we'll just take these, I'm sure the captain won't miss them. On. Anything else in here? Nope. Oopsie. Bathroom. Oh no. We're in the clothes. Turn this off. Don't want to waste water on our onboard spaceship. Be on board a spaceship because we were in a cryo tube, weren't we? There's lots of random crap around, isn't there? Lots of random crap. Random crap. Very dusty as well. Dusty spaceship. Old dusty spaceship. This must be the airlock. Because there's, <coughs> excuse me, spacesuits. This must be the way out. No, lift. I mean, the lift. I'm guessing. Um, let's go this way. Huh. Oh, it's Samuel's. Ah. Oh. Morning, Samuels. Samuels, did you wake up early? Well, I don't really need as much sleep as the rest of you. I was just inspecting the Torrens facilities, a well-maintained ship. I realize it's a very similar model to the Nostromo. Yes, M-Class. A later pattern, but close in spec. I've worked engineering jobs on ships like this. Of course. Is Taylor up yet? She's not a seasoned traveler. Hypersleep may have been punishing for her. Haven't seen her. I'll go check on her. This is, of course, the room where they took, um, Cain, was it? Under that bed. We had an alien attached to his face. 
I missed the button there. What is that? Scan, do the scanning. Here's a question: After the thing dropped off his dropped off his face, the face hugger dropped off Kane's face. Why didn't they scan him again? Hmm. Then, of course, they would have seen that it was still there. I'm just going to try something. Kill me. No, it won't. Just, it just um, pinches you out the way. Looking around the spaceship, something's gonna drop out of there before this game's finished. Samuels is, of course, an android, isn't he? I don't need as much sleep as the rest of you. Or maybe he's just a really light sleeper and acts a lot like an android. It might be a, a deception of some sort. Taylor, good morning. Morning, Taylor. Really, it's certainly not good. I very much doubt it's morning either. Well, screw you then. Sorry. I feel like death. I don't know how you people put up with hypersleep regularly. You get used to it. I don't do long haul very often. Most legal execs don't travel further than the coffee machine. I'm surprised Waylon Yutani felt the need to send legal at all. The loss of the Nostromo and its cargo cost the company a lot of money. It's important we find out what happened. If I can close the case with a conclusive accident report, it'll look great with my superiors. I'm sorry. That was insensitive. Yes. Realized your mother has been missing for 15 years and, and you. It's okay. We'll both get what we want, right? Uh, have you seen Samuels? He's probably been up for hours. You know as well, don't you? All personnel to the bridge, approaching Sebastopol Station. Hang on. Looks like we're up. Read this computer. To N. Taylor. Nostromo Incident, Wayland Yutani, DS9339847. Hey Taylor, I got your case request. It may take me a while. Oh, bugger. Okay. Um. It may take me a while to dig out the files, and the incident happened before my time at the company, so I'm a bit fuzzy on the details. In 2122, the Wayland Yutani cargo vessel, the US. USCSS Nostromo went missing. No trace was found of its cargo and crew. Apart from a new science officer, the rest of the crew had worked together before seven in all. Dallas, Ash, Kane, Ripley, Lambert. Will you scroll down? Oh, page. Page down. Parker, and of course, Brecht. Well, Yutani lost a lot of money from it. It's a bit of a black mark in history. Get an impression they don't like to mention it. Anyway, I'll try to find the files later, clarify some of the points. If you want, I can help you go through them. Maybe some of your luck will rub off on me. I here upstairs have an eye on you for something big. Saul. Better call Saul. Uh -oh. uh, let's look at this one. Basically, what the Torrens is. M class. Alright. Huh. Bugger. Bugger. So basically, the Torrens is a M class that doesn't tow stuff anymore. It's more of a passenger ship now. Hope you all had a restful journey. The Torrens is in very good order for an old M-Class captain. She was a wreck when I bought her. Took a few years and a lot of contracts to refit. She pays for herself now. You said we're approaching Sevastopol Station. Are we docking? 
I believe your contact is Marshal Waits, is that right? I'll hail Sevastopol and arrange boarding with him. Good. Let's get this done. Don't worry, Miss Taylor. Routine. In and out. Connor, how we doing? SMG loaded and calibrated. Approach vector locked. Prep comm so I can say hello. Channel open, Captain. Does everyone have their briefing documents? Briefing documents. You can watch documents. the approach on the monitors. There's, there's something here on the Nostromo, isn't there? Like another corridor that led into something. Nope, I reckon that's going to trigger a cutscene. We'll look out at space first. E. Excuse me. You're not supposed to be sitting there, mate. That's right, you need a thing, don't you? You need to slide in there. And you can talk to mother. Here we go. Can we see it? Switch to monitors. Sevastopol Station. Is that damage? It looks like damage. Punch up 74, tight angle. Looks like the dry dock bay is screwed. Uh oh. I can't bring the Torrens into that. This is a commercial vessel Torrens out of St. Clair, registration number MSV 7760, calling Sevastopol traffic control. We're carrying three passengers on a whale and Utani Bond. You're holding the Nostromo flight recorder unit. We request immediate permission to transfer the passengers portside over. Hello, Marshal? Mar Marshal, this is the Torrens. Say again. The station's comm seem pretty screwed up, so our fitted Samuel suit with a radio booster. I can only keep the Torrens in transit for 24 hours. You'll have heard from us by then. Safe trip. Stand by. My contract doesn't cover bloody spacewalks. It's the only option. And it's perfectly safe if you do what I tell you. Of course they don't, it's the 70s. <laughs> 